Hi everyone, I'm Opie with Opie Photo and I'm here today to tell you what you should be wearing for your maternity session. This first outfit is a sheer lace dress and you can wear um, a nude brown panty or some kind of a nude slip under it. Um, you can shoot this inside or outside and I like this look with um, just kind of a soft floral crown. So this is um, the first outfit that I would highly recommend for your maternity shoot. Something white, light, and airy. So this next maternity look is a blush pink gown. Um, it's long with a train that you can kind of swoop onto the floor. It's very fitted. I can barely get it over the mannequin. Um, and it's a great way to show off your baby bump. And I also like this with a little hair piece, like just a a rose in the hair. Um, this is a really gorgeous look, uh, either in a big open field or you can do an all white um, studio shoot or maybe even a garden shoot with this. Really gorgeous gown. So this next maternity look is actually just a nightgown. Um, I would shoot this only in studio because you'll have to show a little bit more skin with this one. You would wear um, either a nude or white bra and um, a nude or white um, panty under this and then you could pull this fabric back and show off your baby bump in the portraits. Um, this would be 100% studio only. It's a little bit more on the lingerie side um, for maternity shoe. Okay, keep in mind that all of the gowns that I'm showing you today are available at the studio to use for your maternity session. Just let us know what outfits you like the most. So this next gown is um, a light blue color and it's has so many different options. So you can have the gown up high like this, and then you can take these pieces and wrap them over your shoulders this way, or you can pull the gown down under the tummy and then pull these pieces up and over like this, and you can go over one shoulder, you can do um, kind of a halter, you can do a crisscross. There's so many options with all this beautiful fabric, um, depending on if you want to show um, your bare bump or if you want to keep it covered and go with a little bit more of a modest look. So um, this is another really great option for your maternity shoe. Now, I just love the color on this next dress. Um, it is a dark burgundy color and is perfect for a fall or winter maternity shoot. Um, if you are doing a winter shoot and you're going to brave the snow, I would recommend some kind of a hair piece that would tie in the fact that it's a winter shoot. Um, and I love the idea of doing um, a matching lip color to the dress, so a dark burgundy lip color um, for this gown as well. So this next dress I would consider um, a classic maternity gown in terms of there is um, no color and there's not a lot going on with it. It's just really simple. So it um, has no straps and it has no um, sleeves on it. It's just a little strapless piece of fabric here and then a sheer piece here. Um, this is really fun to play with this type of sheer fabric out in an open field. You can just kind of throw the fabric. Um, also in studio, it's really pretty. This is about as classic as you're going to get in terms of um, a gown to wear for your maternity shoot other than black. This is the last gown I'm going to show you. It is a jersey knit fabric. There's nothing sheer on it. Um, it's very modest. This is kind of a goldenrod um, color, kind of a brown yellow. Um, the cool thing about this is that it does have the ties like the blue dress, so you can kind of um, do it any way you want. I currently have it in this kind of halter with a crisscross on the back. Looks like that. But you can um, do it any way that you would like to with these little strappy pieces. And I would also recommend um, probably like a cream flower in the hair with this dress. And this one would be really pretty in a garden. Um, it's one of my favorite dresses and also has a really long train, a lot of fabric to work with. Um, but anyway, if you have any other questions on what you should be bringing for your maternity session or what you should be wearing for your maternity session, 
feel free to call or email me and I can answer any questions that you have. Um, hopefully you've enjoyed this video about what you should be wearing for your maternity session. Um, obviously I've covered um, a wide variety of maternity gowns and I don't really like the idea of um, doing anything like a pair of jeans or like a jean skirt exposing the belly. Um, I kind of like the the more simple look of a gown and then just showing the bump off through the material. So um, it's up to you if you want to go with a modest maternity session or a more um, exposed maternity session. If you want to do something that's semi-nude, draping fabric, or if you want to wear like a full gown for your shoot. Anyway, um, call or email me if you have any questions.